What's up guys, it's Dose Trends here. Try to bring you guys another video for today, man. Um Yeah. If you, if you don't know, hey man, the giveaway gonna the giveaway come gonna be live real soon, man. It's gonna be live real soon. Uh I done announced it a few times in my other videos. Uh, I'm not gonna get too in depth this video. But I'm thinking the live, I mean, not the live, but the um, giveaway should be live. I'm, I'm aiming for Saturday. That might, it might be Friday, but I'm aiming for Saturday. Um, Yeah, it should be live on most likely Saturday. And I'll be making um, follow-up videos going on with that. So everybody um, keep, will keep, um, keep being updated or whatnot on that. Um, but yeah, if you don't know, I can't I can't speak on everything that's gonna be in it again. Um I can tell you I can tell you um stuff that should that will be in it. Um I can't tell you everything because I don't even have the paper the paper right, the right now to um uh, even tell you with everything that I had listed on there. Um but I have a I have a visual of what's gonna be on there. Um the giveaway is gonna be basically like a trucker starter pack. Um it's gonna be an impact, impact sockets, um airline kit for the um tires. They connect to the glad hand. Glad hand. Have you ever seen those inside the truck stop? Um, what else did I see on that list? Um, I think I said fuses, basic tool set, um, multimeter, a blower. Cause I use blowers to blow out the trailer. Um, what else? Oh, um, wire cutter and bolt cutter. I think I think that was everything on that list. Um, but it actually might be actually more things. Uh, we just gotta, you just gotta wait and see, cause um, when I'm shopping, I be trying to tell y'all when I'm shopping at a tool store or something like that, man. I tend to, I tend to pick up more stuff than I intentionally um, thought about buying. Um, but yeah, my um, my giveaway is only gonna be a dollar, only a dollar to enter. Um, I said. Initially, that I, I really only want like one one ticket per person. Um, it's not it's not like a, um it's not like for profit. So it's not like um you buy one ticket, you buy um you spend one dollar, you get um two tickets or something like that, and you buy you spend five dollars, you get twenty five tickets. It's nothing like that. Um, all tickets are just one dollar, bro. Um, I initially said that I only want people to buy one ticket, but um I can't control that. So if somebody end up buying more tickets, I mean they ha they gonna have a more a better chance of winning the um giveaway which i can't i can't um limit one person one ticket per person um <laughs> at least i don't believe so but anyways guys i'm sorry um but yeah it's i'm only charging just just just, to, just so trolls or no, nobody else have a chance of freaking winning um that's not a true supporter of my channel um yeah, I'm looking at myself now, man, on this freaking um, thing. I'm, I was trying to get as much light in here as possible because I didn't feel like sitting in my front, sitting in the front of my truck right now, just for light purposes. I didn't feel like it, bro. It's been a long day. Um, I'm just gonna give you an update, man. Your boy been running. I've been running every single night. I didn't run in the last, the past three nights. Um, and I don't mind running at night, but boy, I, I be drained during the day. So I didn't feel like going in my front seat to freaking record the video. Well, I want to make sure you guys got a video for today. Um, um, you should be loaded up with videos, actually. But um, guys, it's just an update video. Um, let you guys know, man. I've been thinking about my truck lately, man. It's like every time I get a freaking truck wash, uh, and my truck be so clean. Even though my truck don't really be dirty for real, um, I like to get truck washes and whatnot. They give me so many ideas of what I can do to this truck, but. I need to address some things that I need to get fixed, like my APU. APU is still not fixed, bro. Um, I tested my batteries when I was doing my um when I was changing out the alternator on my APU. Um, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get something to actually test my batteries. Um, so I know that my batteries are good because I'm not really sure right now. I used the multimeter, but um, they test they tested like twelve. I think 12.5, 12.56, 12.567. Um, Not 5.67, but 12.57. Um, 
But yeah, it, it tested it tested like right right around there. And I'm guessing um I'm guessing that ain't good to be honest. Cause twelve Um I don't know. I don't know. Um I believe twelve is not even um good to be um kind of starter truck on, but I could be wrong, bro. Um normally it's like a thirteen at least at the minimum. But I could be wrong, bro. So I'm gonna get a tester to test my batteries out. Um, cause I don't want to pay a shot to test when they're going to charge probably about the same amount of money as the freaking buying a tester. And I have a tester in my freaking storage. Um, but when I freaking moved everything from my big storage to that freaking smaller storage, everything is basically pushed up in there, bro. And my tools or whatnot are in there. Not my tools that I, I carry on my truck, but my tools that I um, use when I be at home, like fixing cars or whatnot, it's in my freaking storage. And it's not the same. It's, it's, an older, it's the older style tester. I want a newer style. That can do more. But yeah. So we gotta gotta get that. We gotta get that addressed. Cause I'm, I'm tired of idling this truck, bro. Me personally, I'm tired of idling it. Um. So I'm gonna get these batteries tested. Um. I'm gonna go ahead and buy this. Um. I'm probably gonna go ahead and buy this. Um. Buy this OTR tool so I can run tests on my truck. Uh, it's a six hundred dollars subscription. I think every year, annually every year, and the tool is like maybe a hundred some bucks. Um, but they got a deal going on right now, so they only charge them four twenty. That includes a one year subscription and the tool. So I'm gonna go ahead and spend that four. I think it's four sixty or four twenty. It's something like that, bro. I'm gonna go ahead and spend that. Um, I order that Friday. Uh, what else did I have planned on getting? Uh, Cause I need, I need that just in case, bro. Um, if you, if you, you can force regens. Um, I gotta take, but it can, it can force, it can force regens. Um, you can read codes. Um, what else can you do? You can kick the truck out of D rate. Like if you only can go five miles per hour, it'll kick it out of that, so you can get to a, um, a dealership or whatnot. But it does it does a lot. That can save you money and that can save you a tow bill. Because tow bills, everybody knows, it's like seven hundred some bucks, depending on how far you're trying to go. It could be a lot more than that. But um, what else I'm about to say? So I got to get that. I will probably order that Friday. Um, Yeah, I probably go ahead and order that Friday. I probably wait on my battery, my battery tester, because I've been sending a lot on Amazon. I'm trying to actually be closer to the house when I order that. Um, the other thing, the other thing, the um, OCR tool, I could order that whenever. Uh, I, I I could order that now. I had it just sent to, sent it out and just sitting there. I'm, I don't know. I might order all this at the same time, bro. Ain't about it now. It just be sitting at the house. Just so I can have it there. But um, what else I gotta do? Uh, this truck needs an overhead done. So I probably when I change when I freaking figure out this APU issue, uh, I probably go ahead and do the um, get the overhead fi um done on this truck. People been telling me about the um, people been telling me about the um, about the um, what do you want to call it, man? I'm sorry, I'm all over the place in this video. But the chassis, the chassis lube, um, not chassis. So I can do chassis lube to freaking, um, man, I'm sorry, guys. I'm not freaking still, I'm not always sick, but I am kind of sick from still. Um, not the, I mean, it's the freaking, um, um, the lube gun. I'm going to say that. The lube gun. So you can just freaking um, do the chassis lube on your trucks. So I'm thinking about buying one of those. I'm not sure yet. I just don't want the freaking mess, to be honest, that it's going to have. And I know I'm going only going to be able to put it under my bunk. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm still I'm still thinking about that. I've seen a couple at um, Harbor Freight. i probably get a Milwaukee window. I think I was like two, 300 bucks. But I don't know yet, bro. Um, no, those are like maybe like close to 100 bucks when you get a chassis loop done in the shop. 
do it. it might be worth it that way I can do one like every week um but I'm, I'm not I'm not sure on that yet but um, what else I gotta tell you guys uh I probably go ahead and do an oil change on this truck I really want to get all this done before I go on my Miami trip We need to do to this truck, man. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so we just said the battery. We're gonna get the battery tester and test the batteries out on this truck. In case we gotta, in case we gotta change the batteries, cause we change all batteries at one time. We don't do one or two batteries. Um, if you do one or two batteries, it's gonna put a strain on the other batteries that you didn't replace. And normally those are gonna go out sooner after. Um, normally when you, um, normally when you have a battery. Um, battery issues that one of them are bad or they go bad normally you have like a smell like a rotten egg smell but i haven't smelled that at all but the um batteries can still be bad so i'm gonna test those out hopefully that's my freaking issue with this freaking um why the apu isn't charging i didn't freaking open that box a few times to make sure everything was right everything was connected right everything's connected right so it's not that oh i gotta check, I gotta check the freaking fuse in the freaking arm, um, I believe it's a fuse in the freaking arm um, battery box. I gotta check that. See what I just thought about it. Um, probably check that in the, out in a second. But we gotta get the APU figured out, bro. I'm I'm tired of idling this truck. Um, what else we gotta do? Oh, I've been looking at freaking um chicken lights for this truck. So I think I want to get the um the dual. I think it's they bring on the dual evolution lights on my truck. I want to get those down the side. So I can change colors. I don't really like the um, underglow lights that people put on their truck. I don't really like those. I like the um, I like the chicken lights, the dual evolution. I want to I want to be I want to be able to change those colors. I seen some lights that I can put on my um, my mirrors of this truck that look pretty cool. What else have I seen? I'm gonna change the mud flaps on this truck too. I just need to get a tape measure to make sure I get the right size. Um, they're gonna be Peterbilt um, mud flaps though. What else? Oh, yeah, I want to change the quarter fenders on this truck, too. So, all this stuff is going to be in separate videos. Um, it's going to be in separate videos, but I'm going to try to keep the videos, like, close to each other so they're not spread out. And I don't know, bro. I don't know. Man, just know we're going to get some stuff done in this um, my on my YouTube channel. Some physical stuff done that we can uh, record. Which I could have recorded my freaking... We put on that APU. Me putting on that, I'm sorry, APU. Me putting on that author on the APU. I could record that, record the process, just so you know, so, just so you guys had a um, an idea of what I went through or how to put on an author on an APU, which is a hard job. It's really similar to a car, just made differently, so the boats go in different spots. But um, but yeah, probably um, what I'm thinking about, I'm actually thinking about buying a freaking um, GoPro. I have another camera in mind that I want to buy, but I really need that freaking GoPro so I can do, I can um, mount it to my head and I can freaking um, be able to do repairs and stuff. And you can actually see um, see me doing the repairs and doing swap outs and whatnot. Uh, I have another camera in mind that I want to go buy. That's a 700 bucks, $700 camera. That's the last thing I got to buy real soon, bro. I ain't going to lie to y'all. I really just came back from vacation, so I really ain't trying to, I really ain't trying to spend no money for real. I ain't gonna lie to you. That's a seven hundred dollar camera. I still gotta buy. I gotta buy a laptop or maybe another phone. Uh, for me for to do this giveaway. Cause I'm a, um, I'm gonna call the person live on my channel so you actually see. Um, what else I'm gonna do? I'm gonna call the person live. I'm gonna have that all. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna do all that on my channel. Um, yeah, they might be in a video. I don't know yet. I mean, it'll be live. I might not do a video. That's a lot of work. That's a lot of work. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Um, but um, but yeah, guys. Your boy gotta do some work to my truck, man. You gotta do some work. Um, what else I gotta do to this truck, man? I gotta. Um, it's crazy because I had a freaking slow leak on one of my tires. I don't even think their freaking tire is leaking anymore. Cause normally the air didn't went out in a few days, but it's been a few days and the, the air ain't went out at all. So I don't know what's going on with that. Um, I don't know. 
Maybe it's sealed and stuff. I don't freaking know. Oh, I got a freaking air leak on the front of my freaking truck. So what I'm about to do is freaking, I'm about to freaking, um, not cut the, um, not cut the thing, but I'm about to get a quick connect, get another, get another, I'm about to do a quick connect, get another, um, airline. I seen fleet pride carry the stuff and I'm just going to freaking, um, make it longer because the freaking arrows that they got going into, like, I think, I think it's an ABS box or something like that on the front, a load of um, radiator. I believe the freaking thing is like, it's, it's too short for one because it's freaking, it's like super tight. It's like you can you can literally almost, you literally can't push the freaking hose in anymore because it's so freaking tight. Um, I feel like it keeps slipping out with the vibration. So what I'm gonna do is possibly take that out and just extend the freaking um, airline. That's what I'm gonna try to do. Hopefully that freaking works. And I'm gonna um, cut it. I'm gonna cut it so it ain't freaking like super long because they got a lot of long airlines there um, that they sell. And I just keep the rest just for any other projects I might have on the truck that I need to do. But guys, um, this is just like a little short video for you guys to let you know what was coming next with this truck. Um, but yeah, that's, that's about it for this. Um, I try to document everything. Uh, I've been cleaning my truck lately. I try to get everything um, clean here. But guys, your boy is sick for real. For real. But um, I don't know what it is, bro. I don't know what it, I don't know if it's my dog or what. Be like, yeah, so we came back. I've been sick. I've been straight all day. As soon as I caught on the camera, I'm sick. But um, guys, I'm gonna catch you guys on the next one. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, give me a thumbs up, give me a thumbs down. Tell me you like the video. Um, if you don't like the video, let me know. I don't I don't care, but hey, maybe maybe I could it's something I can critique in my videos. Maybe I can go. Oh, this is what I meant to buy when I was at home. I, I was literally just at home yesterday. Um, I should have bought a freaking um, mic just for you guys to keep saying the audio is not that well. They're good. Um, so I should have did that. But, guys, we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.